So here's what's happening. In a few hours, we're gonna go to dinner, and then we are going to go to the Lego store in downtown Chicago. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm probably gonna buy something. I'm gonna say I won't, but I will. But yeah, right now I'm just kind of hanging out, playing some video games. Oh, and then on our way out of Chicago tomorrow, we're leaving tomorrow. On our way out, we're gonna go to the Discovery Center. And I've been there before, but yeah, we're, we're going. And there's also a exhibit over there, um, blocks to, yeah, blocks to bricks, I think, I think. Um, Adam Reed Tucker like designed it and whatever it's just like a building toys museum I don't know it sounds interesting I found it on some list of Lego related things in Chicago so yeah um hotel tour time oh yeah Sig Fig got the got the sheath now red swords uh, yeah um, here's a Bluetooth speaker that I was using as a tripod about two seconds ago. TV. Here's a, here's a card case actually, like playing cards came in it. I guess they were five bucks. And, um, wow, this is hard to do with one hand. But yeah, this is what I use to, um, travel with this guy. Just goes in there. Uh, rattles around, it's really noisy, but um, it works. I'm planning on putting felt in or some fabric thing to sort of lessen the rattle. Um, but I haven't done that yet, so it rattles a lot. Switch case, uh, self explanatory. Switch with a uh, custom dock hooked up to the TV right now. Um, boring luggage stuff. Here's a here's a bed. I got a pro controller. I got some earbuds, a phone, um, battery. You know, remote hotel guard. Another bed. So uh, yeah, that's that's kind of it for the tour. It's kind of a lame tour. But we are going to Schwamberg today to do the Discovery Center slash, um, it is Blocks to Bricks, the Blocks to Bricks exhibit. Although I might not go to the Discovery Center if the store at Blocks to Bricks is like super awesome. But I don't know, because I haven't been there before, so we'll see. But here's some pretty architecture and bushes and stuff.
do you like to make a famous wheel this big? I'm back home now. I didn't actually go to any Lego stores on the trip, but I did go to Blocks to Bricks, which, if you don't know, it's a sort of museum exhibit um, designed by Adam Reed Tucker, who is the Lego architecture guy. It's not like technically open yet, um, but well, like it's open, but it's like a soft opening, so it's not complete yet. What I got a few things. There's my ticket. So they sell sort of vintage Lego sets and they sell like other building toys um, just randomly. So I got my first um, Series 1 minifigure. Um, they don't, you can't feel them. You just say you want one. So like I went with, you know, Series 1's pretty safe because I don't have any of these yet. Um, I did get the Ninja, which I am pretty happy with because I'm a Ninjago guy. I got a little minifigure, custom torso that's the Blocks to Bricks logo. You can see it there, it's kind of. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. The Bricks Culture um, book on him, which is signed. Yeah. Um, I'll talk about that in a second. Um, but yeah, it's just his uh, sort of story. Um, it's really long, it's like very extensive. Like, it's thick. And I also got, um, Adam had a exhibit at the Museum of Science and Industry. Oh, I guess he designed a Lego architecture style of model. Uh, these are not, this is not a Lego set. Um, these are not Lego pieces, but, I mean, they kind of are. He did design it. Got a signature there again. Um, these, they're sort of just, they don't make them anymore. They're just selling them to get rid of them because obviously um, that event is no longer a thing. So yeah, these were signed obviously. Now those two things um, were like pre-signed, like they were, were sold signed. However, um, Adam was there when I went there, so I actually got to talk to him, which was cool. It was really, it was, it was crazy. Like I just saw this guy walking around and it's like asking, because there's like a museum part. So we like got out of that and then um, this guy was like, Oh, you know, what did you think of it? Like, he obviously worked there. And I'm like, that's, that's Adam. And then I Googled a picture of him just to make sure, and sure enough, it was. Um, so he didn't, like, sign these in person. Um, but, like, I still got them. But he did give me a 2x4 uh, brick, because part of his deal with the Lego group 
is that um, there is an injection molder on in the museum and it like works and they sort of make their own bricks there um, which you'll see in these tower things Oops. Um, so yeah instead of saying Lego it says B B2B blocks to bricks um, so that's really cool so um, in like sort of the entrance to the museum there's like all these glass like cylinders filled with two by fours um, they're not all full yet um, but this brick they're gonna start selling them when the place actually like opens um, so yeah I did not buy this he just gave this to me it was a first first batch of this color that they were um, producing to fill up a little display in the museum so that's really cool um, so this is like probably the coolest thing I got there it's I know it seems small but like this is a first batch like nobody else has this sort of thing so that's just really cool um, thank you so much Adam for giving this to me uh, that was awesome and yeah that's kind of it for the Chicago vlog I guess um, I'll, uh, I'll see you guys later. Um, I'm hoping to do a spinner episode pretty soon. Um, that'll be up today or tomorrow. Probably today, knowing me. But uh, yeah, I will see you around. Bye.